Todd the Maniac. D dude, your thing. He just, he just crashed his spark and it just keeps on going. What is going on, members of the Barrio? It's John coming to you from Waterford, Ireland, and you must be wondering why I'm wearing a bathrobe. We're gonna get to that. I'm staying at this awesome hotel called Dooley's, which is right downtown, and we are about to go explore what they call the ancient east here. We're gonna do this really cool bike riding trip. If you're new here, make sure that you're subscribed and have notifications turned on so you don't miss out on any of our adventures from around the world. Now let's do a quick tour of this hotel room. It's got this classical maritime theme to it. We got a triple. Get to know your traveling buddies fast. You can tell you're with travel vloggers, uh, we have like every adapter ever here. And probably my favorite feature uh, of the room was uh, it came with bathrobes. We were all wearing them last night. It was just a big party in here, wasn't it? Yep, big Ready for an Irish breakfast? A lot of meat. Black pudding, white pudding, sausage, bacon. We're leaving Dooley's Hotel right now. It is right on the water, so uh, excellent location. Couldn't recommend these guys enough. Uh, Waterford is the oldest city in Ireland. It's over 1,000 years old, and it comes from uh, Norse, Water Fjord your history lesson for the day. Now let's go get biking. We've arrived to Kilmac Thomas, which is about the center point of the Waterford Greenway, a 42 kilometer bike trail, which has some amazingly scenic views. Uh, we're starting in the middle so that we can catch some of this. I don't think we have enough uh, energy as a group to do 42 kilometers today. So we're about to go rent the bikes and start this journey. Todd, uh, didn't you do the Tour de France like 15 years ago? Oh yeah, I won. Light drizzle, what a shock, we're in Ireland. We're heading west towards Dungarvan and I think we're gonna make a lot of really cool stops. Going in this direction. You can see our first rainbow of this ride. Right there. We keep stopping every five minutes because we're all bloggers and vloggers, so I think this ride is gonna take a little bit longer than two hours. The weather here keeps changing so much. I'm about to go look for my sunglasses. I've taken my jacket off. We've gone from winter to fall to, uh, I don't know, maybe late May right now. And there's always the, the threat of rain, but it's it's been a really nice ride. Up for a little race? Oh, always up for a race. Well, I just got my butt thoroughly kicked by Dave. Uh, I gotta work my racing skills. We are about to walk in here to get some coffee. Mm. Anytime's a good time for a beer, right? <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. Come yeah. to me anyway. Yeah. <laughs> no problem. Pulled over here, met some really nice local people, and I have to say that uh, the people in Ireland have been some of the friendliest that I've ever met anywhere in the world. They will always get into a conversation with you, ask you a lot of questions, so be prepared for that when you visit. What is it? It's like a... Fairy doors. Fairy doors? Fairies all over the place. So we have fairy doors here? Yeah. Like this one. We're about to go through the tunnel. You know, after doing caving in Doolin a few days ago, riding through this tunnel here is not that exciting. Todd the Maniac. Oh. Dude, your thing, he just, he just crashed his spark and it just keeps on going and he bounced it off the wall. Kids watching us at home do not take drone lessons from Todd. I think I think his spark is okay though. We had to stop here. I think all of our jaws collectively dropped at the same time. And now we're nearing the coastal part of this ride. I mean it's just beautiful. It looks like we've made the home stretch almost in Dungarvan. We're all starving for some lunch, and this is uh, the little bridge. 
20 kilometers later, we have made it to Dungarvan. There is uh, not a whole lot of water here. And I don't know why, because it rains a lot, but we're gonna drop off the bikes. It's been 20 kilometers. We're gonna get some lunch. We're all extremely, extremely hungry. All right, we just had a really nice lunch at this cafe called Cafe Bliss. And uh, yeah, the lady inside was actually really nice. She kept feeding me and Todd all these like uh, little samples. It was, it was insane, it was great. So we're taking the shuttle bus back to where we started and then we're gonna decide what we're doing for the rest of the day. Thank you very much. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna take a break. I gotta go back to the hotel, shower, rest up a little bit. And then I've got one more place we're gonna be going tonight in downtown Waterford. All right, members of the barrio, I had a much needed shower, ate some dinner, and we're gonna cap off this night with a beer at J&K Walsh. This place is a restored, historic bar. It was recommended to me by multiple people in Waterford, so we're gonna see what the hype's about. Just ordered a harp. Cheers, guys. The coolest bar ever. Coolest vintage bar ever. This bar is uh, restored to its original version from 1905, where it was actually part a grocery store and part a bar. There's no music here, nobody's on their cell phones, extremely old school, and uh, I think the kind of place you really need to visit uh, when you come to Ireland. We've just gotten back to the hotel and obviously I need any excuse I can find to shoot a vlog in my bathrobe. Special thanks again to Dooley's Hotel uh, for providing us with these bathrobes. Really cool spot. Uh, you know, I think that Waterford is an extremely underrated city and it's not necessarily on everybody's itinerary, but we found so much to do in about the full day that we were here. Hope you enjoyed all of the footage. Definitely try to consider Waterford if you're you know, making a plan to go to Ireland. We've got one day left and we're gonna do it upright tomorrow in Dublin. Make sure you're subscribed. If you are new here, check out all of my Ireland vlogs in one spot. We're gonna be on the Ireland playlist. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time. Todd, Todd, Todd. Could you, could you do that again? I wanna film that with my phone. It just went crazy.